And let's start with a little warm up movements first. Um, let's just start with, with high, high knee uh, walking, arms and legs up in the air. Not really high pace, but big, big movements with both arms and legs. And if you want to add a little toe raise, you can go up on the toes, get your calves going as well, and you loosen up your ankles a little bit. And if for a bit, we're going to add some speed and go into jogging. So less big movements, but higher pace. Try to stay on your toes with this one. Nice and light. You can go high with the knees. Not necessary at this point. Just to get the heart rate on. And with this one, we often use the countdown to take a lunge forward and swing. So let's do that again. So I give you a countdown, three, two, one. And every time with the countdown, you lunge forward, make a swing. The next countdown, you do the other side. So we start with the back hand. Three, two, one. Step in. Three, two, one. 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 From now on, you do both shots with one countdown. Three, two, one. So first one side and then the other side. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. One more time. Three, two, one. Lunge one, lunge two. Good. All right, shake your legs and arms a little bit. Next one, the squats. 16 basic squats. Reminder, when you do squats, upper body tries to be, should be pretty straight up so you're not leaning or going with a bended back. The nice tight core, bum hits the seat with this one. Toes and knees slightly outwards and 16 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. Then the wide ones, sumo squat, as wide as you comfortably can go. So make sure you don't hurt yourself. Uh, a little bit wider. I like to go a bit wider, more open toes and knees, but try to find what works for you. And 16 times. One, two, three, four. If you feel tightness, don't go too low. It's just to warm up, okay? Here's the count. Seven, <laughs> eight, nine, ten. Last six, five, four, three, Two and one. Last squats, narrow feet next to one another, or at least very narrow position. And now the idea is to stretch your lower back and your knees as well when you go down. So you try to go sit as, as low as you can. As a counterbalance, you can reach out forward with your arms. 10 times. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, and ten. Sideways shuffles. Let me get rid of this. I'm already getting warmed up. Sideways shuffle. So half squat position. One shuffle, stepping in. So a little bend in the, with the outer leg. And then the other side. Side to side. Still a weight shifting. Not going too low. Warming up the inner thighs a little bit here. And then we start opening up the upper body towards the sidewalk. So also open up your toes, but turn your toes and your knee more outside with the last step. So this is the open stance if you, if you hit the ball, right? Turning in, hit the ball. So you can add a swing to this if you like without a racket, just making that movement to get an idea how much power balance you need to hit this shot. And four more times. And stop, good. All right, let's go on the mat. Worm walk, leaning first, leaning forward, couple of breaths to get more space into lower back. So try to relax your shoulders and your neck and your head. Hang as loose as you can. Try to extend your legs. Breathe into your back. Now let's walk our hands into a plank slowly. And then walk back. And repeat. On your own paces, let's walk forward into plank. And then back again. Plank. And back. And stay in the plank position. And jump forward with your right foot next to your right hand if possible, for close enough. It's a lot long and low lunge position. Back knee should be off the floor. So try to extend your back leg and slowly start opening up your upper body towards the sky. Keeping both arms extended. So to follow that top thumb with your gaze as you Rotate and breathe. Come back to lunge position, bring your foot back. And then let's bring the other foot forward. Stay here for a couple of breaths just to let that glute get used to this and start opening up on this side. And slowly bring your arms back down and your foot back and stay in the plank position. We're gonna go a couple of rounds Cobra and down dog. Let's start with the down dog. So extended legs, hips go up as you push your shoulders and your head down. And at the same time, when your upper body goes down, you try to raise your hips as high as you can. And then Go down with your hips on the floor all the way. Shoulders down. And lift your head up. Just stretch your abs and your hip flexors. 
and a shoulder as well. The shoulders can stretch here as well. Back to down dog. Hips to the ceiling. Head down between the arms. And back to Cobra. Okay, let's come up from here. Grab your racket for a couple of shoulder stretches. If you got one by the hand, arms overhead, pulling with the lower arm. Pull the racket down and exhale, stretch. Inhale in the middle, exhale, stretch. And then Continue with big rotational movement. Keep your arms extended. And then switch direction. Drop your arms. And keep your arms in a 90 degree angle and then we go side to side, pushing into the racket with the front arm as we exhale. Rotate and extend. Okay. Last one. Forearms and wrists, little wrist rotation. So all those floor movements where you have to go down. Forearms. Everything is working, moving, flexible, strong. All right. Gonna do this baby on my wrist. So like I said, we're gonna do the first circuit now. And it's gonna be a lot of legs to start with. We're gonna start with squats, not the squat jump. So just the squats we already did in the warm up. So make sure you keep, keep eye on your form. And, and we're gonna have a little bit more pace in this one. And obviously, if you want to go faster than I go, be my guest, or you want to go slower, also good. All right, so we're going to go one minute squats. And next one after that, we're going to go to lateral jumping. Okay, ready for the squats? And go. Remember to breathe well. With or without mask, it's just so important to get enough oxygen. Fifteen seconds to go. Yeah, and stop. Next one, like I said, lateral jump. So if this is new for you, try to keep one leg hovering. And then when you land, you try to touch the toe with the opposite hand to make sure you're low enough. Okay, ready? And go. Oh. 
Five seconds, guys. Keep jumping. Right. Now we're going to go to the backward step, backward lunge. When you take that step, you reach overhead with your arms. When you come up, you jump with the front leg. So we're going to do 30 seconds one side. I tell you when to switch. Go. Oof. Switch. Try to get your back knee close to the floor with that backward lunge. Fine. Next one is forward lunge. Simple squash move. Try to make it a little bit of a lunge. Jump, touching the floor, coming back, then the other side. Go. <sighs> Fifty seconds. Big long lunges, guys. Come on. Time. All right, we're gonna go back to lateral jump and then add a vertical jump. So lateral down. Vertical, lateral, down, vertical, go. <sighs> 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 Come on, guys, higher. Got 10 seconds. Fine. Next one, Burby. Toe jump, push up. Ready? Go. <sighs> <sighs> Mm. 
15 seconds. Come on. Time. Okay. On the floor. Next one. You're going to have bicycle crunches. Pull your back, opposite knee, opposite elbow, go. Keep rotating. Next one. Fifteen seconds, guys. Come on. Oof, work on those abs. Let's go. Time. Stay on your back. We're going to do hip raise, one leg glute raise. So that means you bring your feet, heels close to your bum, lift your hips up, and then you lift your right or left leg up and you keep it isometric, aka static position. Every now and then, check the hips. Can they go higher? It easily drops. And it's easier if you go your leg really high up. Uh, whereas if the leg is lower here, puts more weight on the other leg. So vertical leg, free leg is beneficial. 50 seconds, hold it. Hold it. We got this. Come on. That's the burn. That's good. That's the idea. Five seconds. Oof. And bring your legs down. Shake it a little bit. We are about to go with the other side. Oof. Ready. Lift your hips up. And raise the other leg. Now. Oh, it's really takes a lot of effort to really push your hips as high as you can. Easily stay a bit too low. Try to find that edge, that limit. Oof. Kills the lower leg. And the glute. Ooh. Oh. 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 Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We got ten seconds, guys. Come on. Oof. Oh. 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 Time. Oh. Okay, turn around, get ready for reptiles. So it's a plank position for and bringing the same side knee, hopefully to touch with the same side elbow. Okay, plank and reptile. Twitching the side. Pace is up to you. Oh. <sighs> 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 
50 seconds. Come on. Push it. Time. All right, let's stay low here. Next one is the mountain climbers. So same position. Oh no, not yet. Sorry. Uh, no, we got the side ab jump. My bad. So yo, you are in a plank position again. And you jump to the side, bring your feet next to the body, back to plank and the other side. Go. <sighs> The closer to the front you get the, the feet, the better. Ten seconds, guys. All right, last one. Let's get up. No jumps before the break. Simple. That's it. Yes. Ready? Go. Still have 20 seconds, man. Five seconds, come on. Time. Woo. All right, guys. We end a little break. Get some water. Ah. Ah. I hope you're all feeling okay. So the plan is to go to the cardio ghosting. Going to start with front corners and two minutes alternating with the front corners. Are you guys ready? So moving forward, turning in, back to the T, the other side. So let's go. We got two minutes for this. Ooh, my legs, man. Work on your upper body rotation to get that straight shot going straight. <laughs> so your lower body often is not facing directly the side wall, but the upper body should be coiled up as much as you can. 
gives you more options, better technique, more power. All right, got one minute to go. And if you have limited space, you take less steps, but focus on the swing, the balance, the timing, technique generally. Twenty seconds. Looking good, guys. Let's go. Sometimes you want to go a little bit lower to hit the ball, just to work harder. And stop. Next one, we're going to go side to side. Three minutes for volley. Shoulder high. You can vary at the height with the volley though. But remember that when you volley, there's often less weight on the leg. So make sure you keep it there until you finish the shot. So you're not coming back like this when you hit the ball. All right, racket face, face under the ball. Ready? Two minutes, go. Side to side. Nice little shuffle in the middle. If you have limited space, you go same space you use for both sides. Just swinging the other way. One minute down. Keep your footwork nice and light on the toes with the shuffle. Twenty seconds. Good cardio pace. What's the heart rate? Can't see anything with this thing. Ten seconds, guys. And time. All right, good. Next one. Let's see how uh, we combine the first two rounds. Uh, and the way it goes is you do one side front corner, rail coming back, volley, same on the other side, rail, volley. Use open stance volley just to create a little different position. Excuse me, I'm out of breath. Two minutes front volley, front volley. Go. Oh. <laughs> 
Good balance when you volley drop. One more minute. Thirty seconds. Last ten seconds. Come on. And time. All right. We're going to do one minute, four corners. Back, so we're going to do 90 seconds. And four corners with one step. So front leg, switch, back leg. Same on the other side. Front leg, back leg. Four corners, 90 seconds. Go. <sighs> Rotate your upper body well. Every swing is a realistic swing, okay? Try to lunge into the ball so you get that weight shifting. Forty-five seconds to go. You're halfway. Use enough racket head speed to get a good speed for the ball, so it goes to the back. Twenty seconds. Nice rhythm, good balance for every shot. Come on, we got 10 seconds. Time. Whew. All right, he'll break again before the second serve. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I hope everybody's doing okay. Ready for the last push. We've got about 15 minutes. Uh, whew. Okay, we're going to start with toe jumps, then move to alternate jump, which is alternate lunge. Looks like this. So it's a vertical jump upwards. Uh, knees up, plank burpee, so burpee without a push up. So all nice stuff coming up. We wouldn't like to miss that. Anyway. Okay. That was my promotional chat. Ready for the toe jumps, guys? Ready for the last 15 minutes? All right, let's go. Oh. 
Fifty seconds to go. Come on, guys. Last five. Time. Oh, my. I think I overdid it. Okay, alternate lunge. Next one. Get ready. Go. Twenty seconds. Come on, guys. Woo. Time. Okay. Next one. Knees up. Ooh. Ready? Ah, go. Okay, good, let's go. Please don't sneeze. 50 seconds. Time. Woo. All right, plank, Burby. So it's a toe jump plank. Toe jump, blank, blank. Ooh. Ready? And go. Five seconds. Time. Oh, Lots and twist on your mat. Legs up. Upper body rotate. Ready? Go. Ah. <sighs> 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 
20 seconds, guys, come on. Time on your belly. Superman reach out. So arms next to the body and then reaching forward, lifting your torso up. Ready? Go. seconds. <sighs> Time. Ah, oh, we are halfway. This is the last circuit. Six moves to go. Squad jumps is the next one. All right, squad jumps. Ready and go. Thirty seconds. Oh, oh my. Ah, uh, five seconds. Oh, fine. Ah, oh, man. Lateral jump is the next one. Side to side. Whew. Ready? Uh. Go. Uh. Touch the toes, guys. No cheating on the deck. Ten seconds, come on, jump far to the side. And time. Woo. Back on the mat. Push ups. Woo. Oh, knees down or not, up to you. Ready, and oh. go. Ten 
Ten seconds. <sighs> Time. Next one, mountain climbers. Plank position. So bringing your legs underneath your belly, chest. Fifty seconds. Time. Okay, guys. Alternate lunge. Second round. Ready? Go. Time. Last one. Second round. Toe jumps. All right, guys. This is it. Big jumps. One minute. Last ones. Ready? Go. <sighs> Make sure you jump as high as you can. Let's oh. earn the weekend hours. Last 20 seconds. Big air, come on. Five seconds. Time. Good job, guys. Give a little hand to you and your team. Great job. Woo.